life before us. A Canadian docu-fiction on the lives of the Dunbar family during the Second World War, written by Rupert Payne and Johnny Canister, narration Rob Stevens. The news spread quickly and all were heartbroken to hear of the death of Cadet Dunbar in a pilot training accident at the Bowmanville Airport. Cadet Dunbar had been particularly eager to serve his country in the war effort, and his legacy would be the source of pride for the Dunbar family for generations. Agent X was immediately brought in to investigate what appeared to be a very suspicious death of Cadet Dunbar. Cadet Dunbar's younger sister Myrtle would take the news particularly hard and would never mention the incident again to avoid the pain from losing her brother that she loved so dearly in such a horrific manner. Colonel D. Dunbar was out on the town with his horse Whiskey when the tragedy occurred. The colonel was a dam buster during the First World War and he was an inspiration for Cadet Dunbar wanting to join the service. Swig, Scott, Myrtle Dunbar, Vivian Lee, Cos Molson and Plain Jane would gather one week to the day after the plane crash to spread the ashes of Cadet Dunbar on Fraser Lake. There were many tears shed, but everybody spoke of the good times, too, with personal memories of their fallen war hero.